The Council of Europe Charter on it EDC, HRE, is a legal text which was adopted in the framework of a recommendation of the Committee of Ministers in May 2010. It marks an important step in the whole initiative of EDC, HRE, which officially was launch launched in 1997. But the whole EDC HRE initiative cannot be seen without the political and historical context, which was uh, the collapse of the communist system where the later on new member states of the Council of Europe um, asked the Council to help them on their path to democracy. And this was about in 89 onwards. So from that time onwards, uh, discussion was here in the Council of Europe how and in which way we could help these new member states. And so we did a lot of activities, workshops and so on in the, these uh, states to find out what they really wanted, what they really needed. And this was brought together to the initiative uh, which the official name of which was EDC HRE and which was launched by the second summit in 97, as I said. And then from the then onwards, we had different phases of this project. We talked in the first phase, of course, of the definitions and concepts, but also we created the so-called sites of citizenship, which included not only educational institutions as schools or universities, but also uh, communities, families, ethnic groups, and many others. So the whole, the also the holistic approach that is asked nowadays quite a lot. Later on, the second phase was devoted very much uh, to the school sector to find out what would be needed in school. And then in 2005, we agreed to have a European Year on of Citizenship through Education, which brought this together, the overall approach, but also specifically the education sector, the form of formal education. Already at that time, there were discussions about a framework, a policy framework document that should be uh, envisaged to help better the new, then new member states uh, on their way to democracy. And so we worked quite a long um, time from 2005 to 2010 when finally this charter was adopted. And um, in this charter, the member states committed themselves to uh, make uh, or to implement measures based on the provisions of the Charter. After two years, the first review took place where we sent out, where we did a review and uh, a report was written, a conference took place here in Strasbourg to see what uh, the achievements and uh, the, let's say, challenges were. And it was decided to do a second review and this takes place now in this conference where we also look what has happened in between 2012 to 2017. But, and we can see there are still a lot has been achieved and a lot remains to be done.